Hi, this is Sarah McClure, and today we are going to explore some of the exciting activities that are available at Castle Hot Springs Resort in Arizona. The Sonoran Aerial Walkway is a guided hike to the north of the property. It takes about 90 minutes with stops to explore petroglyphs, a Freemason mark, interesting Sonoran cacti, and of course, crossing the 200-foot aerial walkway a hundred feet above the canyon floor. Now, multiple lines often is them trying to show movement of water. Okay. Right? They're trying to show the flow. Now, you can take this one of two ways. Summer solstice happens, plant your crops because water is going to come through our canals. So we can water our crops, grow our crops, and feed our people. Or it could be a warning of summer solstice happens, get out of the canyon. Yeah because it's going to flash flood, and if you're here, you're going to die. If you look at the way this one is designed, it cuts this way, up, and that way. Okay. This canyon cuts this way, cuts back this way, cuts back that way. So it could be a warning. Right? Okay. 1916, there's a lot going on. Um, this is when the resort really hit its predominant point in history, or was starting to back in when it was originally open. So in the 1920s, this is when all the powerful families from the East Coast Talk about the Roosevelt's, the Rockefellers, the Wrigley's, the Hershey's, the Ford's, all those big powerful families. And all the stone work that you see on property, so the stone house, if you've done any yoga, meditation, mindfulness activities, a gong ceremony, went to the manager reception, that stone house was the original stone that was quarried here inside this canyon and put up to be that stone house. All the bricks and rock around was all quarried stone. Now, people that build houses and do stone work are often called what? Masons. Masons, right? And that symbol is from an ancient organization called... Freemasons. Freemasons, yep. yep. Freemasons. So SJL was most likely a Freemason that was also just a Mason. Um, and they probably sat up here, quarried this rock, because this rock is abnormally flat compared to all the rocks around it. Um, and then left his mark here in time. Yeah. There's two theories. One, scientists believe that it's a traumatic event. So like a lightning storm that hit it and, or a freeze. Well, you ever see trees get struck by lightning, right? So worlds are full of water and this thing will be destroyed. So we know it's not that. Um, a freeze, there'd be more around it that would have the same thing. So what it is, is in the, the latter of the two it thinks it's a genetic mutation. And there's not a single one that looks alike. Yeah. That's why they believe they're our ancestors. And that goes into the reason why they're protected. Right? Castle Hot Springs offers a full menu of spa treatments. The spa cabanas are located next to the creek, which offers an added layer of relaxation.
Castle Hot Springs offers yoga and meditation classes each day. This is where you can begin your day with stretching, breathing, toning, and relaxation. They do allow all experience levels in their classes. The Chocolate Drop Trail is the place to start for some great hiking. This trail connects to other trails and is a great way to see the entire property. The trails are well groomed. You'll want to be prepared with plenty of water. After all, you are in the desert. We did not find this to be a strenuous hike, but you will feel your heart pumping. Hopefully you'll see lots of local animals and interesting plants. You okay with those heights? No. Straight down. The views are stunning yeah. from up here. You'll have the resort on one side and Lake Pleasant on the other. Travis was our guide for Wild West shooting. This is a 60 minute experience available for all experience levels. You'll be trained on gun safety and then have a chance to shoot six types of replica pellet guns. As you'll see, I may have enjoyed this a little bit too much. I hit it! You did. <gasps> Where did I go? There you are. In the red? Dead Look at center. that! Dead center. <laughs> I Good like job. a laser a lot. <laughs> It's <laughs> cool. Oh, good job. Good job. You did. Jack guided us through the desert on e-bikes. This is a two-hour tour. Uh, these palm trees are where when guests would come in from Warsound and drive their vehicles 20 miles down the dirt road, they would ultimately get to park them. We had a little garage over there, a mechanic on site, and the you know early rivets and other ways of fastening on bumpers and mufflers uh, would put these tests on this road. So this is owned by someone different than the people who just took that and then yeah, correct. Yeah. Castle Hot Springs has come under uh, a lot of different owners. 
since it was gone. That line there is Crown King. So Crown King is up on that rocky ridge, um, which was one of the most successful gold mines in this area. We did the guided archery experience with Tommy. This is about 45 minutes and all skill levels are welcome. Alright, welcome to archery everyone. Okay, cool. Um, so today we're going to be shooting some arrows with these compound bows. And so we want to talk about safety first. We're now perpendicular to our target. You want your feet about hips width distance. So we're gonna go ahead and grab the arrow. So you're gonna grab down here. These here are called fletchings. You're gonna grab below the fletchings. And then you're gonna bring it into this position and you're gonna knock the arrow. You're gonna hear a click. Now that arrow is secure, it's not going anywhere. And you're gonna bring it to rest on this black piece right here. The reason for that is when I bring it vertical, it's gonna rest on the metal piece. It's just a nice, gentle touch of the tips of the fingers. I'm gonna start at an angle, and then as I draw open, I'm gonna come more vertical. Line up the tip with the bullseye, and release. Good, Sarah. Sonoran Desert, you're probably going to see a lot of new different species of cacti and shrubs and things like that. I'm going to tell you as much as I know about those things. This is the lower barn and you guys will, if you haven't already, you'll see the upper barn as you head up to the springs or to your spring bungalow later. So the, the lower barn was built in the mid-1920s and uh, this is where all the horses were built. It's also where our uh, first aid operations are based out of. Yep, that's ours. That's Salvation Peak. That's our most challenging hike here at Castle Hot Springs. It's an 870 foot elevation gain over um, 1.2 miles. Our history here at Castle Hot Springs. Some of it is well documented, and we have old like newspaper clippings to, to verify the information. A lot of information or history at Castle Hot Springs, and this is true of just the Old West in general, is just passed on by word of mouth from one generation to the next, and it's kind of folklore. That's the case with the Wells Fargo cave. <laughs> We believe this cave exists because uh, back in the day when the prospectors would come down into the canyon, they would find gold or copper and they would mine it. They would leave the horse and wagon in the canyon as kind of a distraction. And then they would bring their metals and their cookware further this way. Uh, they would spend the night here in the cave.
years ago. Um, and that's how old these Petros are. Now, they're kind of a lost tribe. They disappeared. Arizona went through a 500 year drought. And so there's not a lot known about them. So when we look at this bright green lichen, right? Anybody see anything up there yet? Yeah. You see one? Yeah. Green lichen, everyone see my laser pointer? Yeah. yeah. All right, we're gonna look up to this horizontal crack here. There's one here. Yeah. One here. Yeah. One here. One here, and then one here. There's five going on this wall. Part of a relaxing vacation also includes a little bit of playtime. Castle Hot Springs offers lots of yard games like bocce ball, cornhole, soccer, pickleball, frisbee golf, tennis, and golf practice. Please take a peek at my other videos from our time at Castle Hot Springs. When you are ready to create a wonderful wellness focused vacation experience, please reach out. I would love to assist you with vacation planning services. Thanks for watching and be sure to hit that subscribe button.